The numbers which we use in our day-to-day -day life or in our daily life are based on decimal number system. Based on decimal number system. I'm not going too deep into it, but just briefly that what exactly is decimal number system. Suppose I, I, uh, I take a number um, four, five, three, two, and zero. Suppose this is the number. This number has been written in the form of decimal number system. In this number, each digit is assigned to a place and each place of the number has some value. What is the meaning of place and what is the meaning of value? Let's see that. So in a decimal number system, the first place is the units place or the ones place. Is the units place or the ones place? So ones place. Each place has some value and therefore the ones place has a value of 1. It has a value of 1 and therefore it is ones place. The next place, the next place that is we start from the right and move towards the left. That's the way from the right towards the left. So this was a ones place. The next place has a value of 10 multiplied by the value of the previous one that is this value of the previous one it is one and it has a value of 10 therefore it becomes tens place since it has a value of 10 therefore its name is tens place the next place has a value of the next place has a value of 10 multiplied by the value of the previous place that is this one it's 10 multiplied by 10 this becomes 100 and therefore it is hundreds place Therefore, it is hundreds place. The next value, the next place has a value, the next place has a value 10 multiplied by the value of the previous place. That is 100. It becomes 1000. So, this is thousands place. The next place, the next place has a value of 10 multiplied by the value of the previous place, that is 1000. This becomes 10,000, 10,000 and therefore it is 10,000 place therefore this is ten thousands place so in this example if i have to assign the place i mean if i have to write each digit on their place then zero will come at the units place two will come at the tens place three will come at the hundreds place five will come at the thousands place and 4 will come at the 10,000s place. Now, each digit has been placed at its place. Okay, 0, 2, 3, 5, and 4. In the decimal number system, we group, actually we group the places all together. Like after 10,000, after 10,000, there will be lakh. Okay, again, this chain will go on. This chain will go on. But I will not go deep into that. But the process would be similar. After 10,000, it will be 10 multiplied by 10,000. That will come lakh, 1 lakh. So therefore, the place will be lakhs. 
so each place each successive place is 10 has a value 10 multiplied by the value of the previous one now we group it all together uh, we group the places all together like here it was ones tens hundreds we group them together then the thousands one will be grouped together then if they will be lakh and 10 lakh they will be grouped together and so on okay why this grouping is important because some sometimes you would have seen that numbers are written in this form 45 they will put comma and then write 320 the concept it's the comma is there because of this concept that they group it once tens and hundred are grouped together thousands and then th thousands one like thousand and ten thousand will be grouped together so thousand and ten thousand grouped together if they would have been some other values some other digits uh, which would have the place of lakhs and ten lakh they would be grouped together now why it is important why it is important to group them together since each place has some value each place has some value therefore we can read the number on uh, on that basis if we group them together so how to read the number and how to expand them we'll see in the next video and i hope that uh, the concept of the place of in, in decimal number system is clear to you each digit has a place assigned to it and each place has some value assigned to it the value of one's place is one the value of tens place is ten the value of hundreds place is hundred and so on